Hey guys, so a quick video update on the uh, Eosheen Stack X here. And I have this installed in this uh, Real One S frame. This is the Stretch X version of the Real One frame with the vertical arms. And you can see here I've got the camera installed in this one. Fits pretty nicely here. You can see how it fits in this frame. If you're looking at the Eosheen Stack X and you're kind of wondering what kind of frame to put the camera into, this one works. And um, I used uh, some little 3D printed adapters. This is actually for a Runcam Mini Swift, so for the mini size of 21 by 21 size to a full size adapter. And that seems to give me a pretty good angle and fits pretty well in this frame. Now, the reason I'm making this video is, is a basically a warning on the stack. So if you get the one with the three boards, it comes all together with the camera, flight controller video transmitter board, and the 4-in-1 ESCs. I'm having a major issue with the video transmitter, and which means I'm going to have to probably replace this board because it's got a flight controller and a video transmitter in one. At first, I thought something was wrong with the antenna, so I actually replaced the antenna. My video reception on this video transmitter is terrible. It's uh, I can as soon as I fly, maybe 20, 30 feet away, not very far. My video reception breaks up to the point where I can't really see where I'm flying, which is pretty unsafe. So, uh, and but then when I get close again, it it seems to clear up. So I thought it was the the stock antenna that was included with it. It comes with a little micro FL connector. So I replaced that antenna with a Foxier Pagoda antenna with the little, you know uh, micro FL connector, and that didn't solve the problem. The reception was the same as before. So. There's definitely something wrong with this board. I'm not exactly sure what it is, so I'm gonna have to uh, find another flight controller and rewire all of this, and then put maybe a separate video transmitter uh, maybe underneath this top plate here. Uh, the combo board of the flight controller video transmitter I think is not uh, fully baked. I think it's a work in progress. Something's wrong with it. And I recommend that if you guys are interested in the Eosheen Stack X, and we're interested in the height of camera. I think the height of camera is okay. You'll see the video quality, I'll give you a little sample of that in a second here, along, along with the uh, video transmission that was terrible. Not a whole lot of flight footage, but you can see that the quality is okay. And I think the ESCs are okay too. Um, there's, I think there's 35 amp ESCs. I didn't have any issues with flips to death or anything like that, but I didn't really get to fly too much, so I'll have to see. What I'm going to do is I'm going to have another video later. I'll replace the uh, flight controller video transmitter board with two separate boards, a flight controller and a video transmitter, and then I'll try and get this back up in the air, so stay tuned for another video. I just wanted to let you guys know that if you guys are thinking about getting this combo, which I think is about $100, I would just look at the camera only and forget about the flight controller and board that comes with the combo here, because I think there's something wrong with that. At least for me, it was flawed, so it didn't work. So i got some more work to do on this little project to get this in the air. And stay tuned. I'll let you guys know. If you have any questions, let me know as well. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video.